Hi, water sign. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what's up with me today, but the energy is like so heavy. My last two readings were like, oh my gosh, hopefully your reading is better. Not saying they were bad, but like my energy is really being disrupted today. Like I feel like something is in here trying to keep me. I don't know. Let me just keep going. Okay. So first of all, um, we have a new moon in Gemini happening today. Make sure you see where the Gemini is in your chart, how it's going to affect your life. Gemini rules our third house. Our third house is communications. Anything communications, text messages, phone, email. This includes the media, YouTube, Facebook, IG. So if you want to gain a following on IG, put the intention out there now. If you want to start a YouTube channel, do it today. Do it right now, okay? If you want to um, gain more followers on Facebook, do it today. Do it right now. Anything involving communication, do it right now. Put the intention out there, whatever you want, all right? New moon in Gemini. Let's get it popping. Water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, all right? If you were a water sign, if you're an air sign or fire sign, I'm so sorry about your readings. Like, I have never been this stumped before. Like, this is so wow. I apologize to the fullest, all right? Let's see what's going on for my water signs. Hoo-wee. It's some, it's some big shit about to happen. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. Some big shit about to happen. Lordy. Lordy Jesus. All right. Let's see what's popping. Okay. Also, too, I have added an extra element to the readings. I'll be um, incorporating that from now on, all right, just to give you guys more insight, okay? Let's see what's popping for you guys, all right? Okay, so you have the energy of the Seven of Swords in the reverse. All right, accusations, disloyalty, being unfaithful. Somebody here is accusing you of being disloyal or you're accusing somebody of being disloyal or somebody's being fucking disloyal, period. That, all right. Lies, cheating, deceit, sneaking around somebody's back. Also, too, like, I feel like somebody here is trying to strategize something in their mind, how to sneak, how to steal something, how to sneak around, okay? Like, I feel like somebody here is planning on cheating or planning on leaving without somebody knowing, like, leaving when somebody's asleep, leaving in the night. All right, it's crazy. It's fucked up. But yeah, somebody is being disloyal here. Disloyalty, period, that. You have the energy of the three of wands in the reverse. Wow, because I see, I feel like you're being disloyal, water sign, because you don't, you don't see a future with this person. You don't see yourself growing with this person. You don't, you don't see anything, you don't see it going anywhere. You don't see it expanding, okay? So you're, you're trying to sneak out or sneak away from this person that you don't, three of, wands, three of wands in the reverse. You don't see it going anywhere. You don't see a future with them. You're turning your back on this person. You just don't see it going anywhere at all, all right? The loyalty is not there, okay? Because you don't see it, you don't see it being worth your time. Could be dealing with a fire sign or air energy here, okay? Let's see what else. You have the energy of the temperance. This is definitely done doing this is definitely being done in the dark here. Okay, because you're not you're not like welding or like going off the deep end. It's like you're doing this, it's inside your head. You're being very stealth, very secretive about this. I feel like somebody has their whole bag packed and they're sneaking out when somebody's asleep. All right. But whatever, you could be dealing with a Sagittarian as well. A Sagittarian could just be leaving you like you wake up and the Sagittarius is gone. All right. Some shit like that. Um, but I feel like whatever the case may be, you're not angry about this. You're not bitter. You're not scorned. You're very tempered. You're very balanced here. Like, you know what you want and it's not, it's not this person. All right. Energy of, overall energy is a seven of pentacles. Yeah. Waiting. Okay. I feel like somebody here feels neglected, feels left out because we have the five of pentacles on the ground and then we have somebody juggling here. Okay. So somebody feels neglected, unappreciated, left out in the cold, estranged here because somebody is juggling them. Okay. I feel like you feel left out because somebody's juggling you, juggling you between their job, between two people here. Okay. Or this could be vice versa. You're, you're just, you're just waiting to leave. You're trying to, you're trying to strategize your exit here. Okay, waiting, watching, okay, trying to figure out what to do, where to go, how to do it, all right? But I feel like somebody here is definitely cheating, okay, being disloyal. But I feel like this is more so trying to figure out how to escape. This is like a, this is like a plan of escape here. How do I get away from this person, all right? But I feel like you have to wait. You have to be patient. Something is keeping you in a situation, but you're, you're very tempered. You're calm. You're cool. You're collected, right? Okay. Let's see. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Okay. I 
like whatever the situation is, it's not growing. It's not expanding. Somebody is refusing to grow, expand, uh, to levitate. Like somebody is not growing here. I feel like somebody is staying the same. And it's like somebody's bored. Somebody wants to sneak away. Somebody wants to go. Like somebody, like somebody is catching your eye here. It ain't, ain't this person, okay? Yeah, we have the high priestess. Mm-hmm. A mistress. You're sneaking around with a mistress. You got a mistress. You have you have somebody on the side, period, die. Okay, but this is about listening. Okay. Um, I feel like you're being disloyal because this person does not listen to you. They don't they're they're a bad listener. They don't follow their intuition, neither do you. Um, but, but I feel like your intuition is telling you that it's not going anywhere. You've been saying like, hey, where's this going? What are we doing? What I mean, what do I stand with you? And this person is not listening to you, all right. But I feel like, too, whatever this, this sneaking around is, it's like divinely guided or some shit. Like, you know, you, you just know you have to get away. You know you have to get out of this. You know, like, it's time for you to leave. Like, you just know. It's like something is telling you, something is nudging you. Like, you got to get away from this person. Like, it's time for you to leave this person. It's not growing. You're not growing. It's not going anywhere. You're not expanding with this person. There's no passion here. Like, something, like, you know, something, you, and this has been, like, a long time coming. The seven of swords, the seven, the seventh houses are relationships. You could be dealing with a Libra. But you know, this relationship is not going nowhere. You know, it's like, I feel like, too, um... This relationship is very trying. It's very testing, okay? This relationship, this relationship tests your patience, all right? But this, I feel like at the same time, like, you know something is up. Like, you know what? Something is not right here. Like, something ain't right. Something is telling you, like, something something is off. Like, you know that shit, all right? Because somebody is neglecting you, making you feel unappreciated, not listening to you. All right, someone's juggling. Someone's sneaking around in the dark here. You're like, hmm, what the fuck? I know I ain't tripping. That's how, that's what you're saying. Like, I know I'm not tripping, man. Like, something, something is not right. Something ain't right. And you know it. Okay, so with the three of wands in reverse, we have the judgment card in reverse. Okay, yeah, somebody, I feel like somebody here wants a second chance. You're not giving it to them. You're like, no, I'm not giving you no second chances because, like, you you ain't right. You're not faithful. You're not, you disloyal. I can't trust you. You sneaky as fuck. Or you, you, be on, you be on some sneaky shit and I cannot trust you. So it's like your intuition is saying, don't do it. Do not do it. Don't give him a second chance. You better not do it. You better not do that. Uh-uh. No, no, no. Don't do it. And you know it. You know it's not going you know it's not going to go nowhere. You know it's not growing. There's nothing happening. There's no growth. There's no expansion with this person. And it's like you've been maybe you've been waiting for them to change, for them to evolve, for them to go through ego death, for them to go to like some spiritual awakening, but no. Your intuition is like this person is no good. You better not do that shit. You better not no second chances. Mm -mm. Like, I feel like somebody, it's like something wants to be resurrected. Somebody wants a second chance with you. Be like, no, I, mm -mm. I, don't, I don't think I should do that with you. All right? No shit. Like, because somebody is still dealing with a mistress here. Like, somebody might come back and be like, hey, can we be friends? Or, you know, can I get a second chance? But they have, they got, they still got shit lingering with somebody else. They're still sneaking around. This could be you or the other person. Energy goes both ways. But I feel like you're tempered because you have your intuition working with you. Like, you know what? Let me just let me just keep my cool here. Let me just calm down. Let me just chill out. Because I know I know I'm not tripping. I know something something shady is going on behind my back. Somebody too could be like, somebody could be telling me, you tripping. Somebody could be gaslighting you, like, man, you, you tripping. Like, get out of here with that. I ain't sneaking around. Like, yes, yes, that's they are. Yeah, we have the tennis. Mm -hmm. Yes, they are. And it's not this is not the first time either. This is like this is like leaving somebody for dead here. Okay? Like I feel like this person has stabbed you in the back before like multiple times. Like multiple. You've been putting up with a lot. This is this relationship is very trying. This is like trials and tests, tribulations, one after another. You've been through a lot with this person. This person wants a second chance with you. And you're like, "No, you're too sneaky. I cannot trust you no more." This could be somebody from your past. Of course, or somebody you're with right now. But whatever it is, it's like you're not, but you're not mad about it. You're like, you know, you're very cool, calm, and collected. But you know that you know that this person is a backstabber, this person betray you, this person's a cheater. This person does not know how to talk to you. This person talks to you fucked up too. This person left you person left you for dead, basically. But you're like, you know what? I'm not even mad about it, but no. No second chances, though. Mm -mm. No. I don't I can't trust you. You are not to be trusted. All right. 
shame on uh what is it how does it go fool me once shame on you fool me twice shame on me shit fool me three times i don't know what the fuck is wrong all right you ain't about to fool me again that's what you're saying like no let me get one more card for the um high priestess Somebody wants to come back around, but it's like for what? We don't. We're not gonna. We're not gonna grow together. There's not. There's no growth here. There's no passion. I don't have the passion for you anymore. And like I feel like somebody too has been waiting and waiting and waiting. You, um, somebody made you wait, but like hella long. All right, because they was doing their own thing. They were sneaking around, having a mistress. Now they want to come back to you and have a second chance with you. Why? Like what's like? What are you up to? Yep, the five of pentacles goes in the reverse. So somebody, I feel like this is this is what the conversation. This is what's gonna happen. Somebody you are with, somebody who betrayed you, somebody who cheated on you, let you out in the cold. Okay, for somebody else. All right, um, they're gonna come back and be like, I wasn't doing that. I wasn't with that other person. I didn't. I didn't neglect you. I didn't leave you out in the cold. I wasn't with that person. I'm, I'm not even doing that. I'm not even doing shit. But you know that they were. You know something ain't right about this person. Something is not sitting well with you. Something is making you feel very uneasy here. Okay, but this person is going to try to say, I didn't do that. Okay, I wasn't messing with this person. I didn't mean to leave you out in the car. I didn't mean to neglect you. Can I have another chance here? And you're just like, something is telling you not, not to do it. Trust your gut. Trust your gut. And I feel like you could, be, you could be waiting on someone. You could be waiting on this person to message you or come back into your life. But they're not, they ain't no good. They're not, they ain't no good though. We're dealing with the earth sign as well, but I'm getting I'm getting heavy I'm getting heavy air fire energy here, heavy 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 air energy Gemini Libra Aquarius. All right, this person could have been fucking around with a Pisces, a Piscean, or an earth sign. All right, let me get one more card. Uh, put the three of wands in the reverse, the judgment. Yeah, the seven. Yeah, seven of wands. Seven of wands. Like whoever this person is that's coming back is gonna like gonna um gonna try to lie to you like they wasn't cheating around, they wasn't fucking around. They're gonna you're like I feel like you're not willing to fight for the connection anymore. Now this this person wants to fight for you now. They want a second chance. Can I have a second chance? Can we can we fight for this? I wanna fight for you. I love you. I wanna I wanna be here with you now. I'm not giving up on you, but you're like I you're gonna I feel like you're gonna reject this person. Cause you don't want you don't want a second chance with this person because it's not going anywhere, it's not growing, there's no expansion with the three of wands in the reverse. This person's at a distance from you as well. There's distance between you and this person. But you feel like it's not going to grow. It's like, get back together for what? Like, what are we fighting for here? Like, you're not loyal. You're not faithful to me. I don't trust you. Like, I don't want to do this again. I'm tired. Like, I'm tired of you doing me like this. No. What, what you fighting? Now, now you want to fight for the connection? Like, for what? Why? Okay, let me get one more card for the temperance. All right. Yep. Cancerium. Got the chariot here. Somebody definitely wants to move forward, but it's like... I feel like too, somebody wants to move in with you. Somebody wants you to move in with them. Somebody wants to come and see you, drive to see you today. I feel like this person wants to drive to come and come and tell you all this shit like yeah i want to be with you i want to fight for the connection kind of i want a second chance with you even though yes i betray you um you know yes i was disloyal but i changed okay but like you're so tempered you're like i don't think so i don't want to be with you okay i'm tired of being betrayed by you i don't want to be hurt again let's see what the hidden influence is yeah the two of pentacles you're tired of you're tired of being juggled you're tired of you're, you're tired of somebody juggling you between uh, you and somebody else. You're tired of somebody putting their job ahead of you too, putting money ahead of you. Okay, you're tired of it. You're tired of juggling. You're not. This could be you or the other person. You pick what side you're on. But whatever the case may be, you're tired of it. You don't want to juggle anymore. No, the answer is no. If I can't be number one, I don't want to be nothing. That's what you're saying. Okay, but I feel like somebody's gonna come back, say they changed. Somebody that you've been waiting on. You've been waiting on this person. Okay. But it's like, whatever they're coming back with, is you're not satisfied, okay? It's completely up to you, water sign, okay? So I hope this helps you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, okay? Thank you.